Yeah, my people, today we're working on the Bentley again, taking off the upper intake manifold. So first we're removing the air filter box, that's the cover for it, and the element for the air filter is right below there. So if you wanted to do an air filter change, that's how you get to it. Carefully pry up on the edges of the cover there, it's just a push on right there. And when we get that up, we're going to unplug the mass airflow sensor that's on there. So don't yank it up too far. That's it right there. There's one on each side. So when I take the cover off, you got to remember to unplug it. Those were the two hoses for the um, vacuum supply for the engine brake booster. And then also for the, um, the fuel pressure regulator. Take the screw off just like I did before. Carefully pry up on it. Don't be too rough because these hard plastics will break. And then when you get it up, remember to unplug the mass airflow sensor right there. Take it off, put it to the side. There's the vacuum hoses again. Unplug those. So these, this is a charge air hose. But first, before I get any further, I get some cloth and I stuff it down into the intake ports going to the turbocharger. We don't want to lose anything down there and get unhappy surprises. So this is the charge air going into the engine from the turbocharger. So we're dropping them off on both sides. This is a line that I'm taking off, which is a vacuum hard line that's bolted to the side of the intake manifold as well. So we get that off. So now I am undoing the bolts that secure the upper intake manifold to the lower intake manifold. I crack them loose first and then I use my impact just to zip them on out. I don't really like using the impact to zip them out from start because it's a it's a Allen and I don't want it to um, strip out. So careful you don't want to um, slow your roll or slow your process so i pry it up easily and then now i'm getting the um, intake air temp sensor unplugged because it's kind of under on that side and then carefully lift it on up remove the intake manifold gasket and then before i go any further kind of cover it over because i have some more work to do i was actually doing the thermostat but lost some of the footage but this is as far as i got peace